next and we've got the socal gas and eh, do i want to add that i guess i could add that amazon let's add the amazons uh and th this is another amazon i could add that let's leave that for now in case i want to test anything else audible interest payment okay so then if i go back to my uh, balance sheet and update this uh my my checking account is still uh in the negative <laughs> as a liability but my income over here on the income side of things we've now got our our prime account audible book sales sales uh the web sales and that interest account is down here it's down under uh interest income because we put it into other income down below it seems like the youtube one didn't pull in for some reason let me add the youtube one again i'm going to say youtube and we'll say the account should be youtube right didn't i add a youtube account i did and then if i made a rule up top if we make the rule bank rule i'm gonna say this as long as it contains youtube maybe i'll keep the google youtube as long as it contains maybe i maybe i made a rule that wasn't contained i should check my rules uh, but in any case, let's go in here and say uh, any text field if it contains that. And then I'll delete the second bit. And then it's going to be the contact is YouTube, which we already set up. And then I'm going to say it's going to be an account of YouTube. And then that's good. And then I'll call it, I'll keep the whole, I'll call it google youtube this time which i think is a different name all right let's save that see if it applies out the rule so there's the rule being applied okay so now i can add that uh series let's go ahead and add that and then next and we got google here we'll add that all right so if i go back to the balance sheet update it uh still have a negative cash income statement update it we can now see the google uh pulling through the youtube pulling through all right so now if i go to the first tab if i want to check those rules i can go to the accounting drop down bank banking let's see if i have two google rules which i probably do if i look at my bank rules and i want to update them i i can go into my rules here so these are my spend money rules. Here's my receive money rules. So we've got Stripe, we've got Amazon, and then we've got these two Google rules. So something's wrong with this first one. So if I go in and edit it, let me just see what I did that didn't work. I, I, I said equals, see that equals? And then I deleted the text. If I put contains, it would have been. So now I've got two rules. So I'm gonna go back and see if I can remove that second rule so this is a a a google rule so i think it's this one hopefully i don't delete the wrong one uh, i'm going to take take that off and delete it and so are you sure you want to delete it i'm going to say yeah so the rule has been deleted all right so now if i go back into my account and i go to my bank accounts here we could see uh, that we've added, we've cleaned up a lot of uh, information and pulled them in. I'm going back to my bank feeds and we've applied uh, many of the rules. We've been building our account transactions in the same way we did with the expense side, building them as we pull it in. Then the bank rules should make it more automated uh, for future presentations. We've been reconciling at the same time we make the rules. We've also, if I go to my contacts drop down. I could see that I've been adding uh, contacts, uh, in this case, I'd say customers, uh, as we've been making those rules as well. And then we've been building out our income statement, breaking the general rule of not adding income accounts by customer because we happen to be doing like gig work, which is kind of the exception to the rule oftentimes. All right, and then remember that income account, interest account was down here.
All right, let's look at our trial balance. Right click, duplicate, taking a look at the trusty trial balance, seeing where we stand as of this point in time. Accounting drop down, reports, trial balance is what we're looking for. The trusty T to the B, not tuberculosis, not tubercul trial balance. And you've got the balance sheet accounts on top of the income statement accounts. The balance sheet stops at retained earnings, sales, and then our income accounts, our revenue accounts or sales accounts. And then we've got our uh, expense accounts down below. We're in balance, debits and credits is the same thing as basically saying assets equal liabilities plus equity uh, that we could see here and here. And the income statement fits into the balance sheet because it is summarized in you know the current earnings and the equity 694954 which is also on the income statement bottom line 694954 the income statement breaking out the detail of our performance uh, report